Right away. So, how's it going? Not great. I think the problem might be between Celestia and Luna. Oh, no, that's terrible. I mean, what makes you say that? You know how some ponies say nothing's wrong, but you can tell something's definitely wrong? No. <laughs> that's basically what the princesses did when I said there was a friendship problem. Only they did it more, you know, regally. Oh, I wish I could help you, but I can't. Both for map reasons and because I have no idea. This is big! Like, really big! But I'm here if you ever need to talk or listen to music. <laughs> Comforting, right? <sighs> Thank you so much for breakfast, Princess. I can't believe you cook it yourself. Of course, Starlight. I really enjoy doing it. It's a small way to say, I care. Good morning, sister. Join us? Too tired. Please excuse me. Wow, last night must have been really hard on her. Uh, perhaps, but she is like this every morning. So, both princesses are hurting each other without realizing it. And instead of talking about it, they're just getting colder and more distant. And they're Celestia and Luna, so it's not like you can just confront them. Actually, that's exactly what I was gonna do. What? Are you crazy? I mean, you do whatever you think is best. This is your mission. Gee, thanks for believing in me, Twilight. I do, but the last time the princesses fought, Luna turned into Nightmare Moon, and Princess Celestia had to banish her for a thousand years. That can't happen again. Well, I can't do nothing. The princesses aren't the best at communicating with each other. <gasps> Sorry, it's just you said princesses and aren't the best in the same sentence, and it's making me nervous. I'm not much help, am I? No. Wow. I almost feel bad eating this. It's adorable. Like I said, I enjoy this part. Hi. Uh, Princess Luna, wait. As you both know, the map sent me here for a reason, and I think I found out what it is. Really? Oh, that is wonderful, Starlight. <laughs> what is it? You two. Excuse I beg me. Your pardon. I think you're accidentally hurting each other's feelings without realizing it. Princess Celestia, does it bother you that Luna never notices the wonderful breakfast that you prepare for her? Uh, yes, it does. Princess Luna, tell Celestia how you feel about the fact that she never acknowledges the work you put into lining the hallway with lavender every night. I... well... Uh, it's not the best feeling. I'm sorry I never noticed that you make fruit faces on pancakes, but nights are long for me. You might be a morning pony, but I am half asleep. You think I don't get tired? I'm exhausted. Oh, I apologize for not noticing flowers in a wall sconce, but by the time I get to retire for the night, I can barely see straight. Even so, I still make an effort to smile. <laughs> like smiling is so hard. I I'm sure that's not what Princess Luna meant to say. Is that what exhausts you? Smiling and being adored by every pony? And you have it so much worse, do you? You've spent your evenings flitting around giving ponies lovely dreams. Oh, it sounds just awful.